Welcome back to the channel and if you're new here please do hit that subscribe button and give this video a like. What we're going to be talking about today is the Monsterverse panel that was shown at LA Comic Con. We've had lots of information about this, lots of news has come out both about Godzilla and also Kong and of course the movies that are going to be coming out. Now this is I guess some kind of mild spoilers for Godzilla King of the Monsters but not really. Anyone that knows anything about Godzilla will know exactly what this is and this will come as no surprise but what we have revealed at the Monsterverse panel at LA Comic Con is a brand new cave painting. This is part of the viral marketing. This is a monarch cave painting, which I guess essentially shows Godzilla versus Ghidorah in an ancient battle. But more interestingly, it also shows Mothra. Now what we can see is, of course, Mothra, top left. We can see a rather childlike drawing, I guess, a very ancient cave painting drawing of Godzilla and then in the corner top right we can see the three heads of King Ghidorah with his kind of projectile energy powers coming from his mouths we can see his feet coming down and his tail or what looks like a tail and then in the middle bottom middle this looks to be kind of bird-like creatures which could almost be little Rodans, but that's kind of a stretch. So, in terms of how this relates to Godzilla King of the Monsters, well, Mothra and Godzilla have clearly teamed up in the past to battle Ghidorah. As Mothra in Godzilla King of the Monsters, as we've seen in the trailer, is in a lava form, this version of Mothra, as seen in the cave painting, has clearly died, clearly sacrificed herself, and has then laid an egg, thus you know, birthing herself again and uh, creating another Mothra. So it's it's no surprise that Mothra has died in the past. Anyone that knows anything about Godzilla will know this. It's interesting to see that, of course, King Ghidorah and Godzilla have been enemies since the very beginning. We've seen a previous cave painting in Kong Skull Island, which, you know, showed Ghidorah and Godzilla in combat. Now, whether this was this particular Godzilla, we don't know because... In the original Godzilla movie 2014, we saw, you know, the skeleton of another Godzilla. So whether it's this particular one, who knows, probably likely, or at least at least the species anyway. Now, this particular battle was clearly stopped by Ghidorah being locked in, frozen in ice. And interestingly enough, because we recently learned that Toho had given its approval for all of the Godzilla designs and, well, the Godzilla monster designs, but also the origins and the backstories that they were going to give them. Does this mean that King Ghidorah is still an alien? Well, highly likely. Highly, highly likely. Because, of course, it is called Monster Zero. It's the first one. If this was a native life form, a native titan to Earth, it would be likely that Ghidorah would have killed us off many, 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 many years ago and potentially not succumbed to the ice. Now, a lot of people will probably look at that and say, well, yeah, but he floated through space maybe but maybe not maybe he was on a comet who knows which had an atmosphere we don't know but obviously he's not dead from the ice he comes to life again so he probably just would have been you know frozen in space or we, we don't really know but from my source and what i've heard about these this movie that's coming up it sounds like he's going to be an alien still or at least of a very unknown origin and because he is monster zero he's pretty much the first one or at least the biggest one the the one which predates everyone at the very least. So I wanted to bring you this. Obviously Mothra and Godzilla will be teaming up once more to battle King Ghidorah. Whether they team up very specifically one on one or you know two on one, who knows. But it looks like they will be battling Ghidorah once more. Guys, let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section. As always, if you're new here, hit that subscribe button so that today on all the world of pop culture and movie news. As always, been a pleasure. I've missed H. I'll catch you in the next video.